Well, Jackson Gallagher's rise to the top has been anything but typical. That's right. After an accidental role on the Saddle Club and a stint in the circus, Jackson bypassed a medical career to focus on his acting and he found a home in Summer Bay. I'm addicted to you! Taking on the role of tough guy Josh Barrett. So I haven't seen you around here before? No, it's because I'm not from around here. Jackson Gallagher has been home and away's resident bad boy since arriving in Summer Bay in 2013. You're gonna let him talk to you like that? Go on. Teach baby Braxton a lesson. It's fine, really. And the 25 year old is certainly making his mark. What are you doing here? I told you to keep a low profile. You don't talk to anyone about it, right? We weren't there. Braxton's not gonna let this go. We should confess. Away from the Bay, Jackson flaunts an impressive portfolio, including a big screen role opposite Rachel Griffiths in the horror flick Patrick. It's not us you have to fear. The only thing more dangerous than his hate is his love. With his resume growing all the time, Jackson's definitely proving to be one to watch on the Aussie acting scene. Yes, he is, and Jackson Gallagher joins us now live in the studio. Nice to have you with us. Thank you for having me. Take us back to your Home and Away audition. How did you land that role? Um, well, it's like any other audition. You go in, um, and over the years I've been in and out for a few Home and Away auditions, so I wasn't really expecting to, uh, to get this one. Um, so much so that I walked in on the day and the cast director said, what are you doing here? And I said, I'm auditioning. And she goes, oh, I totally forgot, sorry. <laughs> so it wasn't the best of starts, <laughs> but... Um, it was just having to be the right role at the right time and the rest just fell into place. So I've been, I've been working on this strategy recently. Um, I've been talking to the Channel 7 publicity team and I feel like I need to do like a small three month segment on the show as Jackson's other brother. Because oh. Ty, Ty is your brother. Ty is one of my brothers, but as we have learnt in the Bay, that brothers pop up all the time. <laughs> and, what are we, and we think that perha perhaps you've got a, a, a not identical twin <laughs> brother who's been mysteriously missing for many, many years, who makes a, a freakish have, return have, to the Bay. Have and you has superpowers. And has superpowers. And, and has an age gap of the twin? No, Is we're it? the same age because oh. we're twins. Oh. So we're both 25. And, uh, and then I've got, because there was something about a baby, I don't know, there's a freak baby and there's a, there's a bus crash. There is, but there was a bus crash. No, there's you? another bus oh, crash. Not, oh. But we're working on this. And from working. the crash rises a twin brother. Yeah, like oh. a phoenix. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but at the moment, unfortunately, it's just Ty, yeah. uh, who I'm sort of up against to try and Good luck beat with that, James. Unfortunately, he's a really nice guy. He's such a nice guy. I know, he plays this really tough, brooding character, but uh, off screen, he's so lovely. You, Almost too lovely. You play the bad boy, right? Are you, are you bad in real life? Are you, what are you like? Does it the Terrible. Character? Are you? <laughs> no, you're not. Uh, no, I, I think Josh, the character I play, it started out as a bad boy, but his, his journey in the Bay has definitely been one of redemption and has become um, quite a, nice, a nicer young guy than what he started out to be. Let's move off home and away for a second and talk about uh, working with Rachel Griffith and Shani Vinson. So yes. this was a movie called Patrick. Yeah. And how did it come about? It was so Patrick a bit of a story was, behind yeah, it. Yes, it's a remake of a um, a old Australian horror film, and um, they remade the film a couple of years ago. And essentially, I, I played the character Patrick, who spends the entire film in a coma, but has. Uh, telekinetic powers and starts controlling uh, his environment in an attempt to win the love of the character Shani played. Um, but yeah, it was a great experience working with Rachel and Shani and of yeah. course Charles Dance, who people might know from Game of Thrones. Wow. So uh, as a young actor getting to work with that calibre of seasoned performers was um, an amazing experience. Your life uh, kind of before you hit TV screens was totally different, right? You grew up on a farm, you were riding horses, you actually wanted to be a doctor. How different is life now for you? Um, well, for, compared to that, it's a bit yeah. different, yeah. sure. <laughs> uh, but I think, you know, the main things in your life stay the same, like the, your friends and family. Um, you get to meet different people now, of course. But yeah, it has been an interesting journey, definitely starting from, from med school initially and then sort of I think acting was always something I was interested in and never really thought it was something you could actually have a career or try and get a job in. 
Um, so yeah, it's been an interesting couple of years. Now you guys actually know each other, right? You know, you trained in triathlons and you guys just did a triathlon together. Kind of. Jackson's actually way better than me at any of it though, which is very disappointing. Um, Byron Bay Triathlon. Alex, what did you come out of the entire age group? Uh, we came six. Six. Yeah. And it's made Alex uh, fifth and six. Incredible. It's pretty epic. And how did you go, James? I ended up not making it to the start line for that drive line. Well, we started out as James's cheer squad. Right. And then as the months have gone by and through his uh, coaching, uh, life coaching and triathlon coaching, we've um, had a, a grasshopper moment and sort of taken over from the master. I love it. Maybe you're a better teacher than you are a student. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Jackson, lovely to have you with us. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. You guys can catch Home and Away tonight from 7pm. It is right here on Channel 7.